welcome to Medical Dialogues Journal Club. I am Dr. Nandita Mohan and today I am going to talk about the comparative effect of escitalopram and cetalopram on depressive symptoms of patients with schizophrenia. Schizophrenia we all know is a serious neurodevelopmental psychiatric disorder often characterized by impaired thought process and cognition, poor emotional responsiveness, abnormal social behaviors and various other negative symptoms that actually need early management and consideration as the clinical manifestations of this disorder typically occur in late adolescence or early adulthood and most of these patients experience notable disability and lose their educational and social interaction and functioning throughout the illness period so a recent study presents an interesting double blinded rct study which involved close to 60 patients where two antidepressant drugs that is citalopram and escitalopram were tested to the study reduction of depressive symptoms in patients suffering from schizophrenia the study is published in global journal of medical pharmaceutical and biomedical update and reports that both these drugs are efficient in treating the depressive symptoms with no side effects with escitalopram appearing to be slightly more efficient on an 8 weeks course the patients who had depression based on the calgary depression scale for schizophrenia were included in the study the first group received about 10 to 40 mg per day of citalopram and the second group received 5 to 20 mg per day of escitalopram the patients were treated for 8 weeks any reduction in depressive symptoms was considered the primary outcome of the research although the two groups had no significant difference in the cdss score at the initial assessment after 8 weeks the depressive symptoms decreased and a significant difference was observed between the two groups so the two groups had no significant difference in drug side effects except for anorexia The depressive symptoms decreased significantly after 8 weeks of treatment with both citalopram and escitalopram. However, these symptoms had more reduction in patients taking escitalopram than the individuals receiving citalopram. That's all for today. Stay tuned to Medical Dialogues for latest updates. Never miss a medical update from Medical Dialogues. Like, subscribe and press the bell icon.